You're watching Vini TV, the world's most sophisticated wine media, full of wine snobs, and we are at the moment in Mainz, Germany, anally penetrating the wine scene here and learning new things. And I run up with an interesting person, a true wine queen. Why don't you tell who you are and what do you do? Hi, um, my name is Annika Stebel. I'm from this region, from Rheinhessen, that's in Germany. It's the biggest region in Germany, wine growing region. And um, I'm 23 years old and I study viticulture and onology in the university in Geisenheim. Okay, <laughs> and, I, and I saw you yesterday and I immediately obviously became interested about the concept of the wine queen. Why don't you tell me what does that exactly mean? How do you become a wine queen? Oh, it's, it's, it's very interesting. Um, many girls in Germany want to become a wine queen and um, you only have to be very interested in wine. You have to, be, to love wine, to love to drink wine and um, then you have to go to our marketing center and to say, um, yes, I would like to become the wine queen and then you have to go to the election and um, yeah, it's, it's very funny and, but it's also a lot of work to, to answer all the questions from the jury it's very uh, high quality jury and um, then we have to present ourselves on a stage in our yes, nice dress okay. and um, to present the wine and make an interview. So, so it, it doesn't, it, you don't only have to be pretty, you actually have to know about wine as well. No, you don't. You don't need to be pretty. I think it's um, maybe it's good to be not. So you're ugly. just pretty by accident, okay? Yes. If you say <laughs> this, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah. So you, you said yesterday that it's actually pretty hard work. You have quite a lot of engagement. How many meetings do you have this year? Oh, it depends. It's um, about 200 to 250 yeah, a year, I think. So that's, that's, that's not little. That's quite a lot. That's quite a lot. And most is in the summer. So I had only three in December and in summer there's a load. Okay, excellent. So you're studying in, in Geisenheim. Uh, winemaking or enology uh, and you actually brought your own wine here yes I brought which is my your own wine wine queen wine actually it's kind of funny label you're lying on top of the the label why don't you tell me uh, something about this wine yes it's um, something very typical for us it's typical for the wine queens we usually make a, a own our own wines to present ourselves and um, this is also very typical wine for Rheinhessen it's a Silvana it's a very unknown I think international but um, it's very yeah it's famous in Rheinhessen and um, it's it's like a, a fruity wine and a little bit creamy and um, I love it so much you can combinate it with food it's very easy going and um, it makes a lot of fun to drink it with uh, young people with my friends and I really love this wine and I'm very very proud of this wine and that's because I lie on the top of my label because I'm so proud of this wine and of the wine queen, <laughs> of course. Excellent, so tonight we have the wine ball and you're, you're going to be there, what's, what's your duties in the wine ball? It's quite a fancy event, isn't it? It's a very fancy event, yeah, I love, I was there I think two or three times ago um, and it's, it's, it's very charming, it's, it's so, yeah, I don't know how to say it, it's so glamorous and yeah. I have to go there to, to um, help at the VDP and um, to make the lottery and then we'll go to the, to the very, very famous party at the end and then we'll go together to, um, to dance and to celebrate and... So you will dance with me? Yes, of course. Okay, that, that, that's on the video so you cannot say no <laughs> afterwards. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, excellent. So thank you very much uh, for this interview and I will looking forward to taste your wines later yes, and dancing with you. So this is the Finnish wine king with the wine queen and see you next time. Cheers.